A mother says thieves have broken into her Oildale home more than half dozen times in the past year, but now they've stolen her 11-year-old autistic son's go-kart, and she's fed up. Eyewitness News reporter Mike Deneau has the story. You could have taken my lawnmower, you could have taken my weed whacker, don't take the kid's go-kart. Go Julie Asperger is fed up with thieves stealing from her Oildale home. And a black steering wheel with silver writing that says TJ's go-kart. Late Friday night, early Saturday morning, someone broke into her garage and stole her 11-year-old son TJ's go-kart. Practically my favorite thing that I had. Although TJ suffers from a slight case of autism, coincidentally named Asperger Autism, his engineering skills are advanced. TJ has been working on his go-kart for the past two years. New paint job of uh, I've upped the horsepower and um, I just fix everything on it. The go-kart is the latest piece of property stolen from the Asperger home. Mother Julie says it started around last Christmas when two bicycles, a motorbike, an unhitched trailer were stolen. And then in February, someone stole their beloved dog, Missy, out of the backyard. Which, thank God, we got back. And then they stole another bike, and now they've stole this go-kart. Along with the go-kart, valued at roughly $300, two motorcycle helmets were also stolen, worth about $400. I have seven different case numbers for the police department. Like Missy the Pooch, Julie and TJ are hoping whoever is responsible for stealing the go-kart simply returns it with no questions asked. The emotional attachment to Missy and TJ's blue go-kart can't be measured with dollars. Julie says a majority of her property has been stolen from her garage, and she plans on taking the necessary steps to keep any more of her family's property from ever being stolen again, especially TJ's. Uh, you stole from a kid. That's just, there's no excuse for that. It's wrong. Mike Deneau, Eyewitness News.